Okay, first term that's that's a common ratio is 0.8, that's r, and find the fourth term. I should know it's uh, u to 4 equals a times r to the 4 minus 1, which is 3, and that equals 10 times by 0 0.8 cubed, and that equals 5.12. First part. Second part, find the sum of the first 20 terms. Well, sum of the first 20 terms equals a times 1 minus r to the n all over 1 minus r. That's in the formula sheet. Just substituting things, a is 10 times by 1 minus 0 0.8 to the power of 20 all over 1 minus 0 0.8, and that equals. 49.4235, which equals 49.4 to three significant figures. I've got four marks, now I've got this bit. Show that the sum to infinity minus sum of n is less than 0 0.01. So I've got to know that sum to infinity, what's in the formula sheet, is 10 over 1 minus 0 0.8, and sum n is 10 times 1 minus 0 0.8 to the power of n over 1 minus 0 0.8 and subtract those and it's got to be less than 0 0.01 so 10 over 0 0.2 minus 10 lots of 1 minus 0 0.8 to the power of n over 0 0.2 it's less than 0.01. I'm going to times everything through by 0.2. That gives me 10 minus 10 lots of 1 minus 0.8 to the power of n. It's less than 0.01 times by 0.2 is 0.002. And then multiply out the bracket. This gives me 10 minus 10 minus minus, that'll be plus. 10 times 0 0.8 to the power of n is less than 0 0.002 and 10 minus 10 will disappear and I've got 10 times this I don't want 10 times it and don't forget I can't just do 10 times 0 0.8 because it's not 10 to the power of n so I'm going to divide both sides by 10 and that will give me 0 0.8 to the power of n is less than 0 0.0002 2 and so I've shown it can be written like that and now I've got to use logarithms to find the smallest possible value of n. So I'm going to it says use logarithms so I will I'll log it. I like writing this not first step down because that means I've got to log both sides and just occasionally when people don't write that down they forget to log the right hand side so I think it's a good step. Next thing the power bit comes down to the front that's what that means for my terms n plus log 0 0.8 is less than log 0 0.0002 and I'm now going to divide by log 0 0.8 and because it's less than 1 that is negative and therefore the sign needs to switch around so n is greater than log 0 0.0002 over log 0.8 I don't put the base 10 in there, uh, but you could do any base you wanted to. So n is greater than 38.169. And he wants the smallest possible values, but it's got to be bigger than 38. Therefore, uh, smallest n, uh, n is 39. And that is question 8 done.